Hey guys, I am back with another iMovie video. This time we're going to look at the audio and I'm going to show you just a couple things on audio if you haven't noticed that already. And one of them I'm going to show you is how to elevate and lower the volume on your audio track and also how to go and add a uh, basically a dissolve or have an entry point into the audio or exit point which means it'll basically fade in and fade out. So. Uh, just watch with me real quickly here. If you have not played with um, iMovie before, there's um, you're going to see a bar down here, and you can raise the volume up and down depending on how you need it. And uh, if you're going to be mixing uh, a voiceover, you'll want to make sure that the audio track doesn't drown out your voiceover. So, but most of the time you can get by with you know say 50, 60 percent or whatever. Okay. So, so we've got this going on here. And I'm going to show you um, over here at the end, you've got this dot, okay? So this dot, if you go and drag it, see how it arcs right there? When it arcs, that means that that's good. And it's going to show you how many seconds. That's going to be how many seconds till you actually have the music fade in. So if you want it to fade in with the title, so we'll go back here and run that. that three and a half seconds and then it fades in right there and then if we go to the end of the project I'll show you real quickly I've got it already pre-done here if you look here at the at the I've got a 12 and a 12.8 second where basically it it'll start um, start fading out here so we'll play that real quickly <laughs> pretty professional not everyone uh, it's not apparent right off the bat in some other programs it is but anyways I just wanted to show you that so that's my tip for the day okay take care